I'm Anil Kumar. Here is an application question on slopes of tangent line. Find the coordinates of the point on the curve f of x equals to 3x square minus 4x where the tangent is parallel to the line y equals to 8x minus 1. Let me first thank my subscribers for watching my videos and posting such excellent questions. And I hope the solution of this question is going to help many others. Now in this question, we need to find the coordinates of point where tangent is parallel to given line. Right? So it's kind of a different question. Uh, so we are given the slope, we need to find the coordinates of the point. Reverse, right? Normally we were finding slope at a given point. Okay. So let's find the slope of the required tangent line. When we are given line y equals to 8x minus 1, you know, comparing it with y equals to mx plus b, slope m is equals to 8. So we are looking for a slope of 8, right? On this function, we need to find the point. Perfect. So let's use the uh, standard formula, which is difference quotient formula. So the difference quotient formula will be applied to find the the slope let me give you the difference quotient formula also uh, which gives m is limit as h approaches 0 f of x plus h minus f of x divided by h so this formula will be used to find a general expression for slope at any point and then we'll equate it to a to find a particular point perfect so, so the slope m will be limit h approaches 0. When I say f of x plus h, f of x is given as 3x square minus 4x. x plus h will be 3x plus h. Replace x with x plus h, right? Minus 4x plus h uh, minus f of x, which is the same thing. So let's put it in bracket 3x square minus 4x divided by h. So that gives us limit h approaches 0. So let's expand this 3 times x square plus 2xh plus h square. This gives us minus 4x minus 4h and we have minus 3x square plus 4x correct? divided by h. We get limit h approaches 0. So, from here you can see these two terms will definitely cancel. If they don't, there is some mistake. 4x minus 4x cancels, minus 3x squared, 3 times x squared will cancel. Perfect. Let's open the bracket. 3 times 2xh is 6xh. 3 times h squared is plus 3h squared. And then we have minus 4h divided by h. Here h is common, right? Since h is common, we could cancel these three h's. So we get limit h approaches 0. Or let me go one more step. Let's take h common first. 6x plus 3h minus 4 divided by h. Now we'll cancel it. Common factor that leads to limit h approaches 0. We get 6x plus 3h minus 4. If I substitute x h as 0, I get 6x minus 4 as my general equation for slope at any point on this function, right? Now what we know here is that this slope should be equal to 8. So let me equate. So we have 6x minus 4 equals to 8. 6x equals to 8 plus 4 which is 12 x is equals to 12 divided by 6 which is 2 so you know the x value find the value y substitute 2 in the equation 3 times 2 square minus 4 times 2 4 2 squares 4 4 times 3 is 12 minus 8 that gives you 4 therefore the coordinates for the point are x value of 2 and y value of 4. Do you get an idea? So we get the answer and that is at x equals to 2 
the slope of the tangent on the given function will be parallel to the line y goes to 8x minus 1. Perfect. So I hope with this you understand this strategy to find the answer. They're simple. And thanks for watching. Thank you.